Hello, hello, hello! Welcome, welcome. How you guys doing? Mihoyo just released a trailer that um seems everyone is talking about, and um, many of you guys told me to check this trailer out. I didn't really check it. I thought it's like a like a second trailer for Den Hong, but apparently it's not. So we'll see what it is. Um, yeah, let's get right into it. I have traversed <laughs> great lengths seeking a piece of history. So this is Den Hong speaking. Of long the permanence. I too know little of the progenitor of all dragons. Is that before is that, the dawn? Is that Zhong Li's voice? From Genshin? One of history. No, it's not. Traverse the burgeoning it's chaos, not, it's not. Seeking the answer to existence. And on that path, the revelation of the permanence was unraveled. Then came our emergence, us long scions. I visited Lyaris. That's a planet. That's a planet we don't have yet, okay? A world encircled by five suns. The giant dragon. What are these dragons? <laughs> so this planet has five dragons? Yo. Okay. Sat overseeing the turning of day and night, the change of seasons, shelter, the lives within. Could the revelation of the permanent signify the timeless nature of one's greatness? The relentless pursuit of individual immortality will only breed an unending multitude of malevolent creatures. Such is the fallacy of the plague's author. So then does the permanence represent the continuance of bloodline? I also journey to the ancestral home of the Infernalian people, in the land of white embers. The undead dragon Typhon's breath showered flames on the land below. That looks so sick, yo. Imagine that being a boss, you fight the dragon. <laughs> a weekly boss has like this, yo. Okay, okay. Bringing forth a flourishing thing. Long. So wait, wait, wait. He has like many dragons flying around him. In the land of white embers, the undead dragon Typhon's breath showered. Fl See, there are like many dragons here. This could be the enemies on this planet. I don't know. I'm not know. Just flames on the land below. This looks forth cool. Flourishing Long scions are dispersed throughout countless worlds, living in solitude. Wait, these are two different planets. Is this all about dragons now? Are we getting to dragon lore? What is this? Honkai Ball Z? What is this? In the vastness of the universe, the rise and fall of one race is of little consequence. It is said that the Vidyana formed an alliance with the Xianzhou. Is that Xianzhou? And the elders descended upon the mortal realm to keep watch over the plague mods. Perhaps the permanent. That's the imaginary tree, though. Isn't it? No. That's this is Sienjo, right? Because it has the same, like, light no thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That ensures the safety of the universe. So that's Den Hong. That's, that's the Sienjo. Okay. Uh, alas, Simbibiter Lune forsook his oath, causing a state of great disorder. Oh, that's the, the history of what he did. The bear mortal frailties, their heavy burdens ultimately becoming the shackles which bind them. From your perspective, what does the permanence's revelation truly signify? As the sun and moon rise and fall, the world undergoes continuous change. Yo. What? C Colorum Venti? High Elder of Yuan Shing, successor of the Winged Dragon, Sovereign of Storos? Bound to watch over the lunar... Yo! Yo! <laughs> okay? So the concept of stability is meaningless. Only by comprehending... Another dragon! With the way are... Are Dennis... Re Regia? The elder of... The... I can't read that. Successor, successor of the Armament Primordial Flame? Yo, okay. 
If the world can one's path lead to everlasting existence. Is this something like the Archons with with like Genshin? Is like are, are they saying like Den Hong is the first like kind of an Archon we can collect? Is this what it is? Uh Glaciator Mar Marum. The Elder the Ta So these are different nations. Everyone has their own dragon. <laughs> okay. This one seems ice, the previous one is fire. I think the one before is probably imaginary. I don't know. Countless new creations emerge when one dragon meets its end among the morning stars. For the Vidyata That Ra, looks cool. This is the true teaching of the permanent. Mons Grandis. Yeah, these are all different nations. Holy shit, they all have dragons. Within the cycle of life. Any endpoint may mark the inception of a new journey. And for him. So this is, is no this is the true form of Ambivitur Lune. Damn. That looks good. And I, I I I don't know. I don't know what this is. Like what what can this tell? Is this like, are we gonna get dragons from now? Are we gonna be chasing dragons? So you get the Den Hang, and then we're gonna go for like, what? Where 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 are we going with this? It's cool. I'm excited. <laughs> it just came came. You know you know if, if uh, like this trailer was released with like the game, we could be expecting Den Hong or like whatever. Like uh, in Bibitur Lune is, and then we're gonna get excited to find who he, who he is then we would know there is another archon like right over dragon i don't know man I'm, I'm thinking deep into this but i'm excited <laughs> i'm excited to see what uh, fire dragon could it be and if we even gonna go there because they might be just doing like trailer about the history of the dragons and they're not gonna go into that but it looks cool i would love to fight the dragon as like a weekly boss or something so, yeah. Let me guys know what you think. If you have any theories of what this is trailer about. Um, I think the only dragon I heard of from Genshin is probably Venti. I think. The the uh, wind, whatever it's called. I don't even call if he's a dragon or not, but that's what I think. Maybe Zhongli also count. I'm thinking too deep into this, but yeah. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs> Would be appreciated if you leave a like and subscribe. Stay safe and...